Today's chilly temperatures didn't stop one local ministry from dedicating their time to the homeless community. Jacoby Rivers spoke with members of Narrow Path who say even in the early stages, they're already making a difference. God allowed us to go through the darkness that we were in so that we can reach back into the darkness and bring hope to those who are still there. Meet Mallory and Joshua Hutchison. They recently founded a faith-based nonprofit called Narrow Path Ministries. They spend their weekends handing out food and clothing to the homeless in Gulfport while also taking time to hear their stories. You find out that a lot of things happen to them as children, uh, you know, parents divorcing, abuse, things like that, being exposed to drugs and violence and things at a young age. So it just inflicts wounds and, and causes trauma. And that's what most of these people are dealing with. The couple started their ministry in November of last year and started off small. Uh, God placed it on our heart to start coming out and doing a hot dog and ho hot dog and hope outreach pretty much immediately. Uh, so we've been doing it uh, twice a month now since last year in November. The duo says this is a personal mission for them because of their past. I was in addiction for 23 years. I was in and out of prison most of my life, uh, involved in gangs and different things, and it ultimately led me to on the streets where I had nothing left. Uh, my wife came from the same lifestyle before, so uh, we. Man, we just have a desire and a passion to reach the lost and the broken. Uh, we were fortunate enough to make it out. We were blessed, and uh, we were shown a vision for a ministry. We're both Christian hip-hop artists and traveled the country, and we were doing outreaches and events and reaching the community like this in other places. And uh, once we had the vision, we set the course, we launched the nonprofit, and here we are. They were able to build a men's shelter to help people overcome addictions and mental health issues. And with a devoted team backing them along the way, they intend to grow their ministry with one prayer at a time. Just because people are looking at their, their physical circumstances, that's not how we should look at it. We should be looking at the internal, what's hurting them on the inside. And we all know a warm, a warm meal, a, a, a shower, some clothing, that just does so much to lift somebody's spirit. So, look, addiction doesn't sleep. Homelessness doesn't sleep. All these things do not sleep. So we want to be able to be functioning 24 hours a day to be able to reach people. In Gulfport, Jacoby Rivers, WLOX News Now.